everyone. It's that time of year again. It's time to set up your grade book. The first thing I'm going to talk to you about in, for this video is how to make new categories. So you click on instruction and then go to assignments. Click on edit categories and you'll notice you don't have any because it started a new year. So we're going to click on create category and you will do this for every category that uh, you want in your grade book. I know some of you weight your grades and some of you don't. So um, for this one we're going to weight this at a 70%. Um, and for Miss Ward's grade book, she has access to all four of her course sections. So I'm going to check all of these. And so it will put this category in all four sections. The important thing here is to make sure that you only check quarter because that's where you want to be able to put assignments in. You don't want it to go into progress or semester grade or you're going to have a big mess. Okay. And then click save the category. And then you're going to go back to back to categories. And if you'll notice here, it shows you all four sections have daily work as a category. I'm going to create another one. And we'll put tests and projects. Your, if you are weighting your categories, it needs to equal 100%. So I'm going to make this one 30. Once again, I'm going to check each section and put it only in the quarter and save that category. Okay, now I'm done for this grade book. There are some of you that may have more than two categories. You may have four or five. So you would continue going in and creating new categories and making sure that if you are weighting the grades that um, they will all total to 100%. Also, um, my grade book is a little bit different because I have two different sections. I have a 7th grade and an 8th grade. And so I am not able to get all four sections like this like I did with Miss Wards. And um, so 6th grade teachers, that would apply to you. Math teachers, most likely that applies to you. Pre-algebra and algebra. And other 7th and 8th grade teachers would have two different sections. So when you do this, you would then have to go to your other section. So um, let's say that this was a different category. You would go to one of those and you would have to make new categories into those sections. Okay. Now um, we did it for Miss Wards. We've got these categories in first, third, fourth, and fifth, but seminar was not part of that. So um, we're going to go there and make a category. Okay, and this one is going to be 100%. Okay, and once again, just per quarter. And we're going to say this category. done with that one. So that's what you would need to do. For each new section, you're going to want to um, make a new category. Okay, if you have any questions, you can email me or give me a call. Thanks. Bye.